Alright people, welcome back to another Chaos Plays. We are going to now head to Diamond City um, to talk with the fantastic, wonderful Valentine. Just gotta remember where I'm at now. There we go. Alright, so we need to go that away. That away. We're just gonna port over there. Cause Here we are, back in Diamond City. And I am well I'm going to go in there, see. Ellie? Are you here? Nick? Really you. Well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. About my reward. I always gotta ruin the moment with money talk. Here, every cap we agreed to for finding him. Plus a little something extra. You know, uh -huh. if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can. Well, the the details are, um, well, um, let's there describe. There was a man and a woman, and they didn't say much, but, but I remember they, they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team, professionals, the kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. I'm not sure what the backup means, though. What else can you tell me? We were in a vault when it happened. Um, vault 111. It was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. A lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. Look at that shiny Anything ruby in the back. Remember? It's not every day I witness a murder right in front of me. So, we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers. Anything else you remember? A baby boy. He was kidnapped, and I still don't know why. Good question. Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Now that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners, and of course there's the Institute. So, you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. I'm a synth myself. It's got a prototype anyway. Don't lie to me, Nick. You're one of them. They made you. Yeah, I've heard it all before. You're a freak. You've got something to hide. Blah, blah, blah. But the truth is, <laughs> people smart enough to build something like me are smart enough to cover their tracks. And arrogant enough to throw their unwanted trash into the Commonwealth for itself. You're a prototype? As far as I know. Never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal, and there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. You don't know anything about them. 
Really? Some kind of security setting strips or blocks out those memories. And it's not just me. Any synth that gets trashed, left behind, or escapes the Institute has the same problem. Probably some kind of failsafe. Either way, it's done. Let's move on now. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? I'll never forget that voice. Low and rough. Like... like sandpaper. Cross your face. Not much to go on, but a tough and commanding voice can get someone pretty far in the violence business. What else? He had a handgun. I didn't get a clear look at it, but... That sound... Could have been a large caliber revolver. Huh. I'm starting to get a clearer picture of the kind of man our perp is. Anything more you can tell me? One of them came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Oh, yeah. I heard their names, their home addresses, and where their diary keys are hidden. All right, all right, <laughs> calm down. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. So it is possible, then. Don't jump the gun on me. You said you were looking for an infant, remember? That's over nine years difference by my count. Look, maybe he has a son of his own. Maybe it's someone else's kid. Either way, they both vanished a while back. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. Uh oh, we floating can desk. Out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. Nick. Come on. Kellogg's house ain't far. Okay, well, well lead the way. Alright, fine, I'll lead the way. Whatever. How the f What? 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 I said what what? In the book. 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 Alright, whatever. Go. Do 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 do. Didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think we should. Have you know, dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance? Bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional, quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies. Bum 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 bum. Nine to one odds says he's our man. More than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all in as well. That's right, ladies. There you go. And we feel all right. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> Come on, you can go any slower. Here we go. What? Seriously, I gotta wait for him. Go on. Go. Go. Hey, Valentine. Give me a sec. Did you f oh. Okay. Hey, dog me. You're a good puppy. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this over. Look at them clouds. Walk. Something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Okay. No way I can pick this. Nope. No luck. Just need to find the key. See that platform in the distance? Near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor. Why don't 
don't you go ask around there. I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this along. Sure. The mayor's office is near the entrance of the city. The platform is So just in case y'all didn't know, I have the alternate ending, or alternate beginning uh, mob, which is why some of the uh, wording and stuff, she talks about a little boy instead of her boy, you know, it's a little bit different. What's up? What are you doing here, Piper? Nah, -uh. not until it's in print. Read all about it in the next issue. Really need to work on my persuasion. Reception area, Miss Piper. The mayor needs to make time for more responsible citizens. <laughs> I was just leaving. Dude, your pants are missing again. Bye, Piper. Geneva. The mayor's receiving visitors as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? So I can just head in and talk to McDonough? Go right ahead. His office is open. He likes to make time for everyone when he can. Yeah. Nothing to see here. Um, I see that. Mayor McDonough. Ah, yes. I remember you, our new arrival. I wish I was in your shoes, getting to see our glorious city for the first time. How can I help you? A man named Kellogg used to live in the city. I need to search his house. I see. Well, whatever reasons you have, I take my citizens' privacy very seriously. Even after they've left. I can't allow you to invade someone else's home. That's all there is to it. I'm not invading. I'm, um... Yeah. Doing stuff. Please, Mayor McDonough. This man, Kellogg, I need to find him. Oh, very well. I remember Mr. Kellogg. Didn't like him myself. Paranoid. Never talked to anyone. I doubt you'll find him. But I insist you take the key to his old house. It's been abandoned, though. I'm afraid this whole thing might be fruitless. Thanks, man. Nick. Got the key? All right, let's head in. You do the honors. I plan on doing them around. honors. Kellogg must have left something behind. All to you? Figured a guy like Kellogg would think big. Corn tape. Handcuffs. Here. Did you check out that desk? Well, that's one way to hide a room. This man just sitting here watching. Let's see this. Look at this. Well, look at yeah, this. dancer, All baby. of the Merck's favorite. All now, all now, all now, makes us power. Work it, work it, make it. All now, all now, faster, makes us stronger. Work it, work it, make it. All now, all now, makes us power. Work it, work it, make it. All now, all now, faster, makes us stronger. Work it, work it, make it. All now, all now. Even got himself a homemade pole? No? I don't know. Take that. Take that. 
Gwyneth Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, cigars, San Francisco sunlights. Mm, interesting brand. Nice. Ooh, a ranger helmet. Take one of those. Ooh, a ranger mask. Take one of those. Ooh, a veteran ranger coat. To take that too. It won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. I wonder if dog meat could pick up the scent. Say, hey, that's not a bad idea. Some dogs out there in the Commonwealth can track a man for miles. Well. Dog meat like, seems what? eager for the job. Why don't you let him have a whip? See if he picks up on the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. You have to face Kellogg on your own. Just say so. I want you with me on this, Nick. All right. Well, let's get that bastard. Let's get him. This is your show from here on out, okay? Okay. You say jump, I'll say how high. I'm just gonna take all his shit. Oh yeah, I look like a badass. Who's the bomb? I can give some stuff up though. All right, let's see. Dog. Dog meat. Dog meat. The scent boy. Yeah, that's right. Suck it. Get Kellogg, boy. Take me to that son of a bitch. Motherfucker. Come on, dum dum. We took a boy. Let's go. Let's go get him. A clue. A clue. Great! A clue. Let's go. You're still half naked. Come on, man. Put some pants on. Bunch of fucking freaks here. Go, dude. I'm following you, dog. Kellogg must have stopped here. Search around, see if we can pick up the trail. San Francisco Sunlights. I'm telling you, Kellogg's nose preferred is brand, all right. None. I'll need your nose to track Kellogg, boy. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? There we go. Well, now you run. Come on, we can do it. On the railroad again. What are you doing? Where are oh shit. Bitches. Fuck you. Anything useful? Like another one of Kellogg's pit stops. Keep your eyes open. Lost the scent, boy. Bloody bandages. Dog meat, finds Dog meat can track this. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? Oh. 
shot his. You got your leg shot off, man. The other person got their head. his fucking head off. Who's there? When it's stout, one of his creature comforts. Dog meat pick up the scent again? Kellogg's still out there. We've got to track him, boy. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? And walking dead here. Hey, Carl. 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 Known mercenary. Exercise extreme caution. What have we here? Error. System corrupt. 
I can't feel my legs. <laughs> I can't feel my legs. Uh, Forest. Uh, I think I'm going to die. <laughs> Lula made baby boy. He look up at me. He said, Pete. Just tell me where Kellogg went. Tin can. Identity of assailant. Kellogg. Is your good boy playing with a little bear? So, uh, we're walking a lot. You know, start with. No, 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 no. Wrong. Wait. Deer. That's right. Kill them all. Getting close. What do you think, Feel boy? It. Huh? Look around. Is this our man? We gotta stick together, pal. At least until we find Kellogg. Fort Hagen. Is this the place? Huh? Is he in here, boy? I knew dog meat would sniff our man out. Let's you and I take it from here. Give our four legged friend a break. What's Hello? Is someone present? Not if you're gonna kill me. Movement did they override the size of my target coming more. Well, ain't that a blast from the past?
You want me to take a look at that terminal? I got it, man. Go kill some things, put check on. Yeah, I guess this will work for right now. Yeah, if it isn't my old friend, the frozen TV dinner. Last time we met, you were cozying up to the peas and now Sweet. There we are. Attention. You did it. Let me consider our... Sorry, your house has been a wreck for 200 years. But I don't need a room. Um, I don't want to leave. <laughs> Never expected you to come knocking on my door. Gave you 50-50 odds of making it to Diamond City. After that, I figured the Commonwealth would shoot you out of the trip. Stop. I get it. I do. But whatever you hope to accomplish in here, it's not going to go your way. We will see. Something.
Hostilities. Bitch. I have no idea where I'm going. You got guts and determination. Go. It's admirable. But you are in over your head in ways you can't possibly comprehend. It's not too late. Stop. Turn around and leave. <laughs> you have that option. Not a lot of people can say that. I'm gonna blow myself up, I know this. Survive this, I owe you a stiff drink. Can't even drink. Someone man. should make use of it. came a long way. Let's hear it. So, the boy? Where is he? <laughs> Lady, I'm just a puppet like you. My stage is a little bigger, that's all. Sean's a good kid. So maybe he's not quite a baby anymore, but he's doing great. Only, he's not here. He's with the people pulling the strings. Then you're going to take me to him. Right now. Take you to him. <laughs> like I could, even if I wanted to. Don't you get it? He's in a place nobody can reach. Sean's safe. At home. In the Institute. The Institute? We'll all find him no matter where he is. God, you're persistent. I give you credit, even if it is useless. But I think we've been talking long enough. We both know how this has to end. Uh-huh. Oh, I'm ready. Question it. Is someone present? You must be terminated. <laughs> Thank you. 
bastard won't be hurting anyone else. You should take a look around. Get all the intel this place can find. <laughs> That's why we carry around nukes, people. All this tech. You were barely human. Oh. Fuck you. That's right, motherfucker. Oh, batter's up. The boy Sean successfully delivered back to the Institute. Payment received. New orders to track down Renegade. Gather reinforcement. Cleared out and secured. Hey, Valentine. So, Kellogg wasn't giving us any bull. But even I don't know where the Institute is. And they built me. There has to be a way, Nick. We're in the weeds here. Time to take a step back. Bring in some fresh eyes. Only person I know willing to snoop up the Institute's tail feathers is Piper. The reporter in Diamond City. I say we head her way. Talk this through. Diamond City it is. Hey, chin up. I know the night just got darker, but it won't last forever. Hmm. Alright, people, we're gonna call it. It was lots of fun. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. If you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Slap down that bell, you know, ka -ching, so you know when I post new stuff every week. And, um, yeah, have a great one.